This is Howard of GetFitStayFit.tv weighing in at 228.8 pounds. Today I want to talk about your why you want to be healthy. As I said in the last video that I heard an interview with Tony Horton about a week ago, the creator of P90X, and he said most of us are on this roller coaster ride or never keep the weight off we lose because simply our why sucks. And I got to thinking about this, and there are many reasons to be healthy, right? You, you know, I want to be healthy so I can keep up with my toddler, my four-year-old. You know, I, I want a quality of life. I don't want the last 15 years of my life to be in a nursing home or in a bed like I've known some relatives of mine to be in, in their past. And I don't want to have a heart attack or heart disease. I don't want to mess with any of that. But honestly, those reasons, although good, are not going to get me through the tough time because they're not tangible in my head. And so I just kept asking myself this weekend, why, 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 and kept digging down deeper. And for me, to get to, get to my desired weight of 150 to 160 pounds and stay there represents that I am a disciplined person. Because the only reason I'm not there is because of lack of discipline in my life. Lack of discipline in my exercise habits. Lack of discipline in my eating habits. Lack of discipline in setting my priorities. And unfortunately, this is not the only area in my life that is affected because of my lack of discipline. And my major goal in life right now is to become a more disciplined person in about five to ten areas of my life. In business, family spiritual life, this life, fitness life, and my business. Because in all those areas, I know what to do. I just don't do it. I'm not disciplined enough. And for me, if I can attack this goal and lose weight, because I can't get from 228 to 150 overnight. Um, you know, it's going to take a disciplined approach each and every day to do it. So for me... If I reach this goal, then that is a concrete way of saying I am disciplined. And I know that if I become disciplined in this area, it's going to overflow in other areas and make my life more productive, more enjoyable, because I get frustrated all the time because I'm not where I should be in different areas of my life. Um, so for me, that's the one reason I want to be healthy, is because it would be the perfect picture of me being a disciplined person, which I desire above everything else right now, to be more disciplined in my life. So, what I want you to do today is just think about your why. You know, what is your reason for getting healthy? And it may or may not be the same why that I have. We all have different whys. Um, so, what is that why? Why do you want to get healthy? And leave it in the comments below rate this video, but remember that if your why sucks, then no matter what you do, it's not going to last. So let's really work on this, refine it. I've written this down in my goals journal, written this down in my day planner and other areas in my office. Just do the things I need to do to be disciplined, because I really want this to stick. And this is my one reason in all my goals, um, but especially this one, why I want to accomplish it, because I want to be a more disciplined person. So that has nothing to do with the health benefits, but those aren't motivating me. But this is motivating me that I want to be disciplined each and every day of my life. So again, leave a comment on what makes you motivated to lose weight. Rate this video, and let's all get fit and stay fit.